Hey guys, I just have a really quick video for you tonight. It's a story um, about these french fries that I just bought. So I'm currently in Belgium, uh, in Brussels, which I guess is where french fries originated, despite the name. Anyways, um, I am uh, just walking around the downtown area. It's very, very touristy here. So uh, what that means is everyone speaks English. All the businesses speak English. Um, of course, I'm trying to avoid that because I want to practice my French. And so I walk into a French fry. Well, they're not called French fries here, they're called frites. And I walk into a frite restaurant and I order some frites. Now, like I said, we're in the most touristy part of Belgium where everyone speaks English. All the businesses, all the employees, they all speak English. But I order in French because that's just what I do. Um, and the guy who is, is selling me my frites, um, he speaks to me in French back because that's what I started the conversation in. And he speaks so fast, I do not understand what he's saying. And so I ask him to repeat himself, and he does. And I ask him to speak slower, and he does. And he literally had to repeat himself like maybe four times. And I still had no idea what he was saying. I don't know if they have a different accent here in Belgium or if that was it or if my, I was just having a brain fart or what. Um, but whatever happened, I just did not understand him. And I was getting really embarrassed. Um, and my face was turning red and stuff. And finally, he says, do you speak English? And I have to be honest with him. I say, we. Oui. And then, so he just starts speaking to me in English. And it was just really embarrassing um, because I felt like I was kind of being a fraud by pretending uh, not to speak English at first. Um, but you know what happened? I was in there and I was embarrassed for about 30 seconds or a minute. And the guy gave me my fries and I walked out and that was it, right? It wasn't any big ordeal. It wasn't life threatening. Um, it's not something I'm gonna remember and well, maybe now I'll remember it uh, because I'm videotaping this story, but it's not something that I'm gonna worry about or freak out about for my whole life. Um, it was just a short, I don't know, it was just a short little uh, embarrassment that was ephemeral. It just, you know, I was embarrassed for a very short amount of time and it passed and now it's over. It's important to recognize that these short, tiny little embarrassments are not anything to freak out about, right? My life isn't any worse off because I humili humiliated myself in the french fry store for about 45 seconds. Um, I honestly, I don't care, it's over. This just happens two minutes ago, or three minutes ago, and I don't, literally don't care anymore. And that's just the attitude you need to have. And so the moral of the story is, why are we so afraid about getting embarrassed? Embarrassment literally just, it happens, and then it just passes so quickly, and then it's over. Um, and I think that it has really profound connotations for the language learning endeavor. We spend so much time about worrying about what people are gonna think of us or, or being embarrassed with our language learning. I don't know what's going on over there, but apparently they're very happy. But anyways, we spend so much time worrying about being embarrassed when really I think the key is just to allow yourself to be embarrassed for a little bit and just not worry about it. It's just, it's gonna pass and then it's just gonna be over as soon as it started. Um, and so this is not really a significant factor that we need to take any interest in or that we need to worry about. Um, there's much more significant factors like, uh, am I learning my language? Am, am I practicing enough? Um, you know, uh, how much progress am I making? Um, and then there are other factors like, am I wasting someone's valuable time in the store that that's a, that's a reasonable question to ask yourself but a good question an important question to ask yourself is not am i going to be embarrassed because embarrassment is just such an 
inconsequential thing to worry about. So that's it. That's all I have to say to you guys tonight. Um, this was just a random video that kind of popped into my head as I was walking around, just as I was walking out of the restaurant, actually. Um, I'm almost done with my summer in Europe. Um, so here in about a week and a half, I'm going to start uploading videos much more regularly, like I used to twice a week, every week. Um, it's just been a little bit difficult to stay on schedule since I've been here in Europe um, with very, you know, busy with classes and stuff and, and with my Camino. Uh, so I'm really looking forward to that and uh, getting back in touch with you guys regularly uh, two times a week. And that's it. That's all I have to say. Thanks for watching the video and we'll see you next time.